Okay, this is reality. Hello, um, hi, uh, hey. This is like what's left of my personality after working all day, but I really wanted to make a video still. I haven't really gotten to use my new camera as much as I want to because job. So um, today I decided, I didn't know what I was gonna do to be honest, but I knew I wanted to talk about music. I was like, maybe I could slap together Should I Dig, but that needs to wait. Um, I like to take a little bit more time on those because it's a lot of stuff to cover and I like to make sure I am somewhat organized. So I decided I wanted to do something casual and I wanted to talk about music. I got a comment on my last video about um, asking what I've been listening to, which is one of my favorite things to talk about. So I am currently getting Spotify up on my computer. I don't know if it's just me, but my laptop is a 2011 MacBook Pro and She's not what she used to be. She's amazing and she does everything I need her to do, but it's not necessarily the fastest thing ever, which is fine. Speed isn't everything, we know that. So I'm kind of just gonna go through my Spotify and start to find stuff that I've been listening to lately and see if I can lay down some of that for you. Having a cup of tea, which I hope I don't spill on my laptop, it would be the second cup of tea I've spilled on my laptop. So, you know, smash that like if you make cups of tea all the time and just forget about them, just hold. Okay, let's do that YouTube clap one more time. <laughs> okay, my Spotify is finally here and ready for action, I'm thinking. Let's just do it. Let's just fucking jump right into it. So lately, what can I think of? An album that I've been listening to constantly, 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 constantly. Um, I get in the car, I kind of throw this album on. Bad, bad, not goods. Five? What is the Roman numeral IV? Is that five? Should I Google really quick or should I just fucking take the L? It's four. That was a fucking journey we just went on, but I've been really loving four, which is IV by Bad Bad Not Good. The album is truly great. Um, I will start it from the top really quick just so you can kind of get a little bit of a vibe from it. Cause it just starts off right away. Well, Speaking Gently is my favorite. That's Speaking Gently, and then my other favorite on the album is Lavender. Just a really cool album. I feel like it's something you can put on, have in the background at a party or anything like that. There's nothing super unsettling in the album. I feel like it's very listenable for me anyways. It's very my kind of vibe. So I've been listening to that album a lot. Been listening to Travis Scott's new album. Say what you will about Travis Scott. Say what you will about that weird fucking shit that happened with them taking Amanda Lepore off the album cover. It's tea. It's tea, no doubt. But um, who knows what actually went down there. I'm one for second chances. I'm one for wanting to hear an artist's art or art artist i don't know travis scott for me is a really good like i'm going out i'm feeling good been liking that a few songs just kind of like honestly the bangers on the album stargazing carousel sicko mode my boyfriend really likes coffee bean just because it's such a different style for travis scott but honestly when i'm listening to travis scott i'm trying to go off but i i'm still like here for experimentation within your art I've been really loving Prince lately. I've always loved Prince, but um, I just go through vibes all the time with feeling out different artists at different moments. And I've been really liking 1999 and Raspberry Beret. I think Raspberry Beret is one of my favorite songs of all time. I might still put that in my should I dig or talk about it because that song is kind of getting me through life. So 
It's definitely gonna be on my um, top 2018 Spotify list. I'm calling it. I've been loving Tierra Wax new album, Wack World. I'll talk about that more in Shit I Dig, but listening to that, Tierra Wack is amazing. She's amazingly talented and she's awesome and her style rocks and I love her and I'm super fucking excited for whatever she has in the future. I'm here for it and I can't wait. I've been loving Ween. As always, they're actually coming here soon. I just, can I afford it? We'll see, stay tuned. I kinda wanna make it happen one way or another. Um, I've been really vibing with Temporary Secretary by Paul McCartney. It's kinda crazy, but it just shows a glimpse into how crazy and diverse Paul McCartney's songwriting. Say what you will about not being obsessed with the Beatles. Say what I will rather. And Paul McCartney is a huge talent and um, not to be denied in my terms. You can deny him if you want. I've been loving, oh my God, this is a really good one. I've been loving Nia, I believe you pronounce it. Nia, N-I-I-A. She has an album called I that came out in 2017 that I've been fucking vibing with. It is sultry, it is sexy, it's intimate. She has a beautiful voice, it's relaxing. My favorites on the album being Nobody, which the music video is incredible. She looks super duper hot in it. But I think my other favorites are actually the more like romantic and ballady, beautiful, soft, gems on the record, which I think would be The Last Night in Los Feliz and All I Need. My Mac speakers aren't really gonna do it justice, but you just gotta listen to it in headphones, like in the bathtub, or maybe not headphones, in the bathtub, but ugh, her voice is like, All I need is beautiful too. You kind of have to be in a mood for that. Like, see what I'm saying? Like Travis Scott, some nights, Nia, some nights. It just matters where I'm feeling and where I'm at. Um, Erica Badu, let me just take a moment. She's definitely gonna be my shit I dig. Maybe this is just like a prelude to my shit I dig, honestly. I love Erica Badu and as a human, as an artist. I've just been putting her on her This Is Erica Badu Spotify playlist. If I had to choose a favorite song, Mm. I really like Orange Moon. I really like Cleva. I really like On and On and Other Side of the Game. And just, I just love her. She's a fucking icon. She's one of my heroes, honestly. Oh, I will talk about one more thing and then maybe I'll just save the rest for my should I dig. My best friend Riel sent me a link to a YouTube video for a music video by um, Massive Attack. It's a Massive Attack song off their EP from 2016 called Ritual Spirit. And the song is called Voodoo in My Blood featuring Young Fathers, a group from Scotland. And oh God, I really love the song first of all, but the music video, bitch, oh my God. The music video, I'm gonna put a link in the description, needs to be watched. What is the actress's name in it? From Gone Girl. Rosamund Pike. Oh my, I'm not gonna spoil anything. Go watch the music video. It is actually inspired from the movie Possessions from 1981. Really cool music video, really cool song. Definitely worth checking out. It's kind of definitely has a darker vibe to it. So maybe if you're in that mood, check it out. My cup of tea is done. This is a sign that we should wrap it up. So I'm not gonna get too much deeper into that. I really I really do need to save some more for my Should I Dig video, which will be coming out pretty soon. I'm gonna be trying to upload weekly the best I can while maintaining my basically full-time job. So thank you for watching. As always, if you don't already, follow me on Spotify and you can watch what I'm listening to all the time. That's the tea. I'm going to bed now.